Hello, people of the world, this is Chef Apollo 99, and I am back with part two of episode two of The Walking Dead. So I'm going to hop right into it right here and see where we're going. Am I going to ask her some stuff? Not such an easy job. Just a friendly it? nod. It's okay. I know you're still watching out for me. Of I course I am. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Lee, Kitty, I know I ran out of food before. Hey, it was a tough choice, but you took care of the kids. That's what a real man does. <laughs> Thanks, Kitty. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. Well, you're out. What happened to my food? Screw you. I could have fed left. him. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk, old man. <laughs> yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. Well, who cares? What do I do now? Can I, like, speak to her? We should think about leaving here. Maybe we should think about leaving the motel. God, not you too. I know Kenny wants to leave. I think that's why he's so eager to get the RV working. Well, I mean... But this is a good spot. Oh, is we're it? We're protected. We're close to the drugstore. We ain't got no food. We have a routine now, and it's working. Ain't got no food. I have no food left for you. Lily, I... Uh... I see how it is, Lee. Talk to you later, okay? Fine, then. Guess I'll go... I don't want to talk to her. Guess I'll go try to find that god dang hat. So can I come this way, or it just doesn't let me come by these? Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Uh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, I'll look at that. At least the kids have something to keep them occupied. The girl, she needs Clementine. She needs her hat. Can I pull out my axe? Why can't walk forward? Get this out of the view. Come on. But I don't want to be over here. God dang it! Where can I get that hat? Can I come like this way and like? God. Oh my God. Can I pass? No. Can I go in the RV? Oh my god. Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. It's probably our best bet. Probably. I'm not sure that's the best idea. You gave Glenn your blessing when he left. Just asking you respect my choice as well. Yeah, but he was leaving to find his friends. Your family's right here. Well, here isn't doing us any good. It isn't. It got no food. coming with us, you and Clem. The coast does sound like a smart idea. The coast does sound like a smart idea. Maybe that is the best thing. I know that it is. I'm taking my family. How do you know for sure? Where's that hat at? Sitting on the table. Come on, walk. Better. Talk to this guy. Hey, is my friend going to make it? Nah. I don't know, but Kaja will do her best. I promise. I can't believe you chopped off his leg. Had to, to bro, if you wanted him to die. I guess you wanted him to die. So who are you? So who are you people? Our group's gonna want to know. I'm Ben. Ben Paul. The man you saved is Mr. Parker, the band director at my school. We all came down from Stone Mountain for the playoffs. Oh. When, when everything happened. How you holding up? How you holding up, kid? Uh, well, I, uh, I keep wondering if I could have done something to help, you know? Some kind of, I don't know, something. I don't know either. I don't know either. It's killing me. Killing me, Relax. too. We'll get your friend back to normal in no time. I sure hope so. I don't. God dang it. What do you got to say? What should we do about the kid? What should we do about the kid? 
If it were up to me, I'd let him stay for a while, see if he proves to be an asset. But that's up to Lily, and with her in charge of the food, I don't want to get on her bad side. I'm out of food. <laughs> Sorry I ran out before I could give you any food. Hey, don't feel bad. I'd almost rather starve than eat most of that stuff. Besides, you've done plenty for you me. You don't like no cheese food. and crackers? Sleeping any better? Sleeping any better? No. I know we should be grateful for beds, but no, I'm not. Well, Drugstore? you're very selfish. Yeah. Back in a bit. What? Why is he just like drugs too? What does she have to say? She make you get my hat. Still have that walkie-talkie? That thing doesn't work anymore, does it? No, not since it broke at the drugstore. Just gonna hold on to it then? Yes. Yeah. If that's okay. I, um, I need it. It's okay, huh? She's like a secret agent. You She's said like, they'd I need find it. us. I know, I did. And until then... Look, uh, Clementine. I'm not stupid, Lee. I know it's just pretend. But it makes me feel better. Okay. I don't think so. You take good care of it then. I will. Um, well, I don't know... You'll be okay. ...what I'm supposed to be uh -huh. doing. I'll be okay. Um, there's like nothing I can like, can I just leave or something? I guess I'll see what she has to say now. She'll say he died, probably. I need space, Lee. Well, oh my god. Where am I supposed, what am I supposed, can I get up there? What am I supposed to do? See what he has to say. Hey, you holding up okay, Lee? I was pretty fucked up back there. Having to cut that guy's leg off. Yeah, yeah. man. I just hope Kanja can save him. Um. Yeah. Ever missed the Air, Air Force Base? Air Force Base? I mean, this wall isn't exactly military standard. No way I'm going back there. You saw what it was like when you guys picked me up. Completely overrun. Sorry, I'm out of food. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Just wasn't enough food to go around. Can I, I enter the motel somehow? Decisions. Just get me next time. Exit. Need any help with the wall? No. Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Ah. Uh, yeah. Give us that thing for a bit. Ah. Uh, I don't want to give it to Larry. He'll probably kill me. I'm gonna give it to him. I'm gonna give it to him. Here, this should help. Better not kill me. Try not to make too much noise. Yeah, yeah, we're not stupid. Come on, Larry. Give it a rest, man. Things are different. Being a racist is outdated. Oh. <laughs> That's what it is. Is that what you told him? No. No. Yeah, that's right. I never said that. No. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. And what are you going to do about it? Kill you? Look. I don't care what it is, but you two have got to start trying to get along. The only thing I have to do is protect my daughter. And right now, that means getting this damn wall fixed. So I would appreciate it if you two would shut up and let me get back Well, to then work. fix the goddamn wall. Maybe I can get in the hotel. Hotel. Motel. Ken, Lee, come here, please. He died. He, he dead. It, did he? he lost too much blood. God damn it. He dead. <laughs> sick of this shit. Well, calm Can't down. You don't even know him. Let him go. Let him go, Katja. What? He just needs time. It's been a rough morning. That man you brought, I tried, but he was never going to survive. That if I did it, he probably would have. What about the other kid? Let's just kill him. Oh! Oh! Q? Oh, really? 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 I was not ready for that up. I need my axe, Joseph! Kill him. Oh my god. Oh my god. Get out of the damn way! 
Oh god. Oh. I'm gonna kill him. Um, I'm kind of kicking at him. Um, no. Um, no. Kill him. S. No. Ouch. Ow. No. Oh my god. Please shoot it. Please shoot it. Oh, thank god. How did he get in here? You okay? Did he kill um Kenny's wife? Or did she get Why'd out of it? Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! No, I ain't. I thought he was gonna kill me right there. That was intense. Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He oh, was he was bitten. That was him. Oh, it was the guy that she was working on. Wow, I didn't even know that. I thought it was the guy got in. Wow. Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? What? It's not the bite that does it. Um, what? You come back no matter how you die. <gasps> if you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's just death in general that causes this. walkers? Oh boy. We're all infected? Uh, how do I do that? Yeah, two. We're all infected? <laughs> I forgot Everyone? the controls for a second. I, I guess so. I don't know. I all I know is that I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. Oh boy. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. Oh no. A lot of them. Oh, Jenny Fisher. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and God. What a shame. Back off. What? More Whoa, people. Lady, relax. Me and my brother, we we just want to know if y'all no. can help us out. I said back if off. we have a decision, I ain't helping them. We, no. You're outnumbered here. You're outnumbered here. Just turn around and go back. Okay, that's fine. Uh, but but you'd really be helping out a fellow survivor if if you could part with some no. extra gas before we leave. Nope. Why do you need gas? To leave, probably. Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. He likes that. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. No. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Oh, they got food. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. So, uh, what are y'all thinking? Yeah. Okay, we'll go to the dairy. Sheesh. Got a deal. Sheesh. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. All right. I guess I'll. So I guess I'll dairy, help you out. You guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And nice. with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. Well, it's that's nice good. To get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. Oh, really? Me as a leader? You think they'd want me for a leader? Sure. Everybody looks up to you. Well, oh, yeah. thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Larry knows. Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine might know. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore. Asked me about it. I lied to her, but... What exactly did happen with the senator? Um, it was an accident. It was an accident. I mean, I, I pretty much knew about the affair. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Yeah, they probably Maybe don't like right. that. Listen, over the years I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I'm a pretty bad man in general. I am. Just saying. I really appreciate that. I might kill you right now. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? Make him. 
Macon. I thought it was Macon. I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? Do I have... It's a, dem it's a democracy. We work as a group. All of us looking out for each other. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? Nine, including the kids. Nine, including the kids. You forgot Ben. Me? That makes it ten. Oh, hey, well, Ben. We'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra help. Helping hand. <laughs> In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Ooh, yeah, that's great. Goats. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's. You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? What? Shit. Damn. Oh boy. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always fucking this bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided my camp. Oh, oh man. Fuck you. Fucking you knew we were hungry. Really and you guys were keeping it up. There's only two of them. Oh no, there's only two Yeah, you know what? We ate it all. What are you gonna fucking do about it? Don't worry. Danny and I got you covered or something happens. But let's just wait this out. Alright. <laughs> I'd laugh if they turned and saw us. like. And of us. Oh, he's dead. Yeah, real smart. There are gonna be billions of walkers coming now. Snipe him out. Come on, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. Yeah, let's get to the dairy. Alright guys, it looks like we made it to the dairy. I think it's a good place to end this episode off. Hope you enjoyed. And don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. See you guys.